Look at the baby pineapple. On the agenda for this morning, we're making Bloody Marys. Hannah's got all types of ingredients. We're gonna do them really well. I will be contributing radishes to the mix. We got cucumbers, carrots, tomatoes. All right, we got all of our Bloody Mary uh, ingredients, and now we're heading to the beach because Sam and Han are gonna take a little dip, um, refresh yep. themselves. Here they go. It's pretty chilly out. You ready for this? You're always ready. I don't know. I don't even know what's gonna happen. Okay, you ready? I know your head feels the best. Oh, watch out! <laughs> there they go. Whoa! Whoa! Hey, how was it? It was great. Yeah? Are you cold? Right? Was it really cold? It's cold. Yeah, the ice behind us. Nice. <laughs> They're trying to convince me not to be afraid uh, of going in mean? next time because like shark yeah. attacks are so unlikely. So uh, yeah, I don't know. It's still, I have not been in the water in California since I've been here. I fell in one time in Redondo, but I've not gone swimming one time. Um, but I'll get over my fear eventually, I promise. Cool. We found a little side table that we're gonna get. It's very open. This lady's just a dumbass. So you're in a Mini Cooper. <laughs> Min literally, your car has a Mini in the name. Sam with another great find. It was me, you guys. <laughs> I just want you to like him. I mean, I like the bacon. Hannah just made some excellent Bloody Marys. You can see the leftovers here. Here's what the finished drink looks like. We use the silly straws. <laughs> Take a sip. How is it? <laughs> really good. <laughs> really good. And we're gonna enjoy them on the patio with our new patio furniture. Uh, it looks really cute out here. Sam and I are sitting over here, drinking ours. All different colored glasses. It's just a perfect Sunday morning. Yeah. I would do. I love Bloody Marys because they have so many snacks inside, and I know there are hidden ones down there like a radish and olives. <laughs> you can bring them out here. Hannah's bringing more snacks. Yep, bring the grape tomato, please. Oh, this is so nice. Mmm, look at that. Very nice. There's something in my teeth. Uh, nope, nothing. <laughs> Perfect. Perfect. <laughs> Our friends had to go back home because Carl's leaving for Costa Rica. He has an awesome job. And we're thinking, now that we're down there Bloody Marys, we might as well graduate to mimosas. So we're gonna run to 7-Eleven and grab some orange juice because Sham brought champagne. Sham. <laughs> Sam brought champagne to celebrate him getting a job, which will eventually happen. <laughs> but we can celebrate him getting a Vespa and us decorating our house. That was that funny. <laughs> Someone said pretty good. Someone did? Yeah. He almost hit a car. Mm. 
I'm not sure what all the celebration is for. <laughs> really cool We're calling this Eskimosa. <laughs> So we went on another Craigslist adventure and found this old 1980s projector and we can't get it to turn on. It looks really cool, but I don't know if it'll work. It came with a screen and everything and a remote control. I really want it to work. Holy All right, it, it, really whoa. Work. it just turned on with the remote. Wow, look at the lights. What? This is so cool. Holy crap. It's the static. This is the weirdest thing. This is like an alien something. <laughs> Are you changing the channel? <laughs> Look at this old remote. Go to channel 15. Look the at mirror. it projecting on the trash can. Like without the mirror? Yeah. What's the, the mirror, mirror for? isn't mounted. But where does the mirror even go? Uh, we're at Target and we're looking for a DVD player because the projector needs to be plugged into a DVD player in order to work. So that's our next task. And this is a St. Patrick's Day wig. Found a DVD player. I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna try it with the projector. If it doesn't work, <laughs> if it doesn't work, then we'll get rid of everything. If it does work, it's gonna be awesome. We're gonna project it probably on the entire wall or on the screen. And that will be our oh, new little in-home theater. Oh my god, we got the projector to work. This is crazy. This is sick. This is the weirdest thing. And the speaker is working everything. Should we put the screen Yeah, let's up get the screen. Put the sheet up? Let's the screen. Yeah. Now it smells like something's burning coming from in there. It's really old, so it's possible. All right, we've attached the screen, and this is the craziest thing I've ever seen. We have to put the mirror here so that it projects onto itself. This is like, what does this remind me of? It reminds me of 2001, like weird technology. And I don't mean 2001 the year, I mean the movie. Okay, so when he puts the mirror on, it projects it onto the screen. Oh my god, this is so cool. It's huge! <laughs> freaking thing. This is the weirdest thing I've ever seen. I feel like it's going to teleport us to some weird dimension. It might. Maybe it did already. Baby. What if we went outside and... There it is. Zorro. <laughs> I have to say, I had such a good Sunday. We started with Bloody Marys with our friends, took naps, yeah, we got to pick up this amazing piece of equipment that Sam just jerry-rigged. Look at that. Pencils. <laughs> Insanity workout discs. Perfectly on screen. He's picking out a movie right now. I just made some puttanesca pasta. And it smells really garlicky in here and delicious. And we're just gonna relax and have a cozy evening. I'm pretty happy with today. But then you know there's always drums and bass and maybe even one day a tambourine. We just finished watching 10 Things I Hate About You. Both the roommates passed out watching the movie. Uh, yeah, I had a really great day. Tomorrow, Sam and I are back on the job hunt. Uh, we'll probably be walking around downtown looking for applications, things like that. I have a few videos I need to work on. Uh, I got some work done ahead of time, already filmed food with Dottie. Happy about that. Uh, but yeah, Chelsea comes in two days. She's getting here on Tuesday, and I'm so excited. Everything will just finally be in place, and all the roomies will be here, and I don't know, it's just gonna be so much fun. Um, I'm gonna go to bed so I can get up early tomorrow. I hope you guys have a great night, and I'll see you then.
California, oh California is waiting for you. California is waiting, is waiting for you.